broadcasting from Mabula, Kuwait. This is the Me and Larry reality video show, LTL Editorial News for August 10, 2009. Headlines The Taliban, here's my uh, acronyms, how I'm going to say about these two Taliban groups. Uh, the Taliban in Afghanistan, that's the TIA, the Afghanistan, Taliban in Afghanistan, still striking hard in Kabul. And here they went after the government uh, building again, uh, rocket strikes, and uh, they really heating things up before the election. Mm. You think uh, they trying to stop corruption or they just trying to stop the election, uh, period. But the TIAs, the TIA, that's the Taliban's in Afghanistan. Oh, they still going. Hey, they like the Energizer Bunny. But what the NATO, I guess the U.S. coronation needs, uh, there's a song for it. Send in the drones, the unmanned planes. Go ahead and send them. U.S. Air Force, just send them and just smoke those boys and send them up to the mountains. And then, might as well hear the, the words of Tyrese Gibson when he says, bring the rain. Bring that radioactive rain on the mountains so they could get hot. And then while they get hot, and then you send those drones and smoke them. The crew and Ben Laden and that blind dude. And so get them out of the way. In other news, the Taliban in Pakistan, that's the TIP, the tips. Hey, they are saying, don't believe the hype about what's going on with our leader. They said our leader uh, is still alive. He didn't get killed by the drones. That's uh, talking about Batula uh, Mushab saying he's still alive. Oh yeah, right. Don't believe the hype. What are you gonna have? Uh, Flavor Flav in this, uh, in this uh, show when he hanging, hanging out in Pakistan with a clock? Maybe one of the guys run away or clock and say, you know what that is, boy? But no. Hey, here you are, you're blaming Western media saying that he died. And then you, you guys are saying he's not. Well, then i tell you what. Hey, bring him up. Even bring him up from the dead. I don't care. Dig him up. He'll be like Bernie. Hey, Bernie on weekends that movie. But anyway, yeah, dig him up and let him sit in a chair and see if he's still alive. But anyway, as we continue on, uh, the Mexico summit begins where you have President Barack Obama, you got the PM from uh, Canada and the Mexican president all joined together in a group picture to see if um, those two, Canada and Mexico, are going to buy into the U.S., um, wherever the U.S. can sell for them. I guess it's a bargain basement uh, deal for the U.S. so they could get on their feet to work or else you might as well have Walsh Perot as the opposition saying, I hear that sucking sound. And, and usually uh, it'd be like a toilet going down. But anyway, LTL got a question of the week. And this question is, would you, would you work with a company for less pay or work as a contractor in a dangerous environment? That's LTL question of the week. Would you stay working with a company for less pay, 
like uh, the airlines, some of the airlines people, uh, that have them to work for less pay or work as a contractor in a dangerous environment. Also, uh, other news, this is kind of like a bombshell. Paris is not Michael Jackson's daughter? Well, news kind of leaked out to find out that this guy who was a longtime friend and a child, former childhood actor, Mark Lester, uh, brought up, was saying that uh, Paris Jackson is his daughter. Michael accepted to take the fraternity test to claim the daughter, but he, he said she got the resemblance of me, my face and everything. I knew that was going to pop up after he died. That was going to pop up. Yes, it would. And so, Catch the Circus is in town. The Michael Jackson Circus. <sighs> it's continuing. And then ending is the Jetta TV. The Jetta, which uh, provides um, good quality um, TV in uh, Saudi, in Jetta, and that's a Lebanese uh, television. They and also Mohammed Jaboon. What a name, Jaboon. Well, they both got shut down. And uh, one, the Judah uh, TV, because of uh, their license wasn't valid, uh, quote unquote. Like uh, they can pull off anything these days. And then Mohammed Jaboon, of course, when he bragged about his sex life, he said, hey, uh, this is what I did and such and such. And for braggers like that, you need to be put away in jail for bragging. You, you kind of like an insecure man. Uh, you, yeah, you must have had a song called, I'm just a love machine and I don't work but the bloody but you, da, 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 you know, in Arabic language. Yeah, trying to show your bedroom and all that. But you don't need to. Hey, be like Will Chamberlain back in the days. Show, show your girls and, and then prove that you are a love machine. But this is LTL Editorial News for August 10, 2009. Sounding off.